Damn, look at this place. Anyone attacks now, we're gonna look like burger patties. All part of the thrill, right, brother? You got some cojones. But all you gotta do is look up. This whole joint's looking to come down on our heads anytime. Telling you, man. Live around here long enough and we'd all wind up looking like them kids back there. No hope, no future. How did it all end up this way, man? Base? Where's that Rondi? Should be at your two o'clock. Look for a flashlight. Over there! Man needs new batteries. It's Morse code. I ain't seen that in years. What's next? Smoke signals? Whoa! We got company! <laughs> Let's give them a warm welcome. They're in the air, too! This is bullshit! I got the aerial units! Gonna blast them out of the sky! Yeah, I'm fine, bro. This ain't nothing. Danny boy, a freaking star, man. Off more than we could shoot. You okay? Be right there. You tried to get yourself killed. You okay? Be right there. I'll handle this. Didn't sign up for this shit. But I need a little help here. Whoa! We got company! <laughs> Let's give them a warm welcome. They're in the air too! This is bullshit! Gonna blast them out of the sky! Yeah, I'm 
fine, bro. This ain't nothing. <laughs> Take five, I'll handle this. Alright, that takes care of the aerial threat. Like that? We ain't no pushovers, bitches! Picking your heel, shit! This is bad! Okay, Danny boy! Leave it to your big bone! I'll distract you with the deep boy! You blast it, alright? I'm using a decoy! Now there's fire! Am I good or am I good? You owe me, brother! Oh shit, don't this boy ever get tired? <sighs> Shut up and jump! Yeah! Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> that scrap head is really starting to bug me. Fire in the hole! Shit! Oh! oh!本部長、六本木でもレッドアラートです。警備行動中のグランランサーから機能停止信号。堤防に侵入した連中だな。ええ、そのようです。グランランサーを倒したのか。えらく重装備で来たもんだ。本部長、お台場での画像です。ただの密
They started it. Base to be to one. The land clear base. Sorry to burden you with my clowns. No disrespect intended, sir, but you Yanks do tend to make a lot of noise. Know what I mean? Not all of us, Gregory. Just those two. So, where's everybody else? Well, the French are already inside the city. They said there'd be a Chinese squad, too. The file photo doesn't do her justice. She looks familiar. Reminds me of an actress or someone. Come on, Bo, you know the only movies you watch are porn. <clears throat> oh, yeah, right, with the... Hmm, yeah. <laughs> hey, watch this. Excuse me. Hi, I'm Dan, and that is my partner, Bo. Ni hao. Ah, the strong and silent type, huh? I like that in a woman. Maybe if you pair learnt some manners, she might not be so silent. Well, rough with the smooth, man. So, this is all China sent, huh? Just one woman? I am First Lieutenant Fei Li of the People's Liberation Army. My two subordinates were killed by security robots on the way here. Aw, oh, shit, listen. We didn't mean no disrespect. Hard to believe you're the one they called a survivor. Well, appearances can be deceiving. You ain't that special. Just real lucky. No luck? Well, that's good. Because we could all do with a bit of luck. Because the Japs consider anyone without official ID as an invading hostile. So, we're all in the crosshairs. Speaking of, sir, we'd better get moving. Right, Peter one to base. Now moving to first contact rendezvous. Roger that. Base out. Got some local help in the Shibuya flood zone. It's this way. The 21st century started off pretty bad, and only got worse. Sea levels rose, climate went to hell, and three quarters of the major cities around the world were flooded, ruined, and uninhabitable. Local and national authorities rebuilt upward, above the waterline. Whole new cities, using the old as foundations, and leaving the lower layers, the flood layers, to rot and decay. But a lot of people had already died as the world collapsed. Who was going to build these incredible new structures? Robots. I call them scrapheads. But then, I've never been a fan. Not that anyone cares what I think. Fact is, we needed robot labor like never before. One company rose to dominate the market. Bergen Advanced Robotics Technology from the USA. Bergen has a 95% share of the global robotics industry. Of course, they didn't get there without ruffling a few feathers. Most famously, the Amida Corporation in Japan sued Bergen for stealing its technology. But by then, Bergen was already huge, and Amida lost its case. That was the last obstacle between Bergen and world domination. Thanks to them, the USA is now the global superpower. In 2040 AD, the world's remaining economic concerns ratified the new Geneva Convention. One of the most controversial parts of it was Clause 21, which banned research into robots that could pass for human, or hollow children, as the media called them. Forty years later, a hollow child attacked Bergen's headquarters in the USA. He didn't just fool the humans. He seemed to have no idea he was a robot himself. I'm Sergeant Dan Marshall. I work for the IRTA, the International Robotics Technology Association out of Geneva. The IRTA set up a global task force called Rust Crews to deal with breaches of the convention, especially Clause 21. We've got full support from the US military, which is where I used to work anyway. <laughs> Some things never change. 
And that's how me and my partner Bo ended up in Japan. Because the U.S. suspects the hollow child who turned up in America was made by Yoji Amada, legendary robotics genius and the founder of Amada Corporation. We're here to arrest Amada and take him to Geneva at any cost. That means we get to knock out any scrapheads that try to stop us along the way. <laughs> I sure hope they try. Right, we split the two teams from here onwards. One in the front, one bringing up the rear. I mean, at least one team makes it through should the worst happen. Yeah, well, I don't like hanging back, so I'll take point. Why can I remind you that I'm in command here? Not that I expect pulling rank would benefit your attitude. So, who do you fancy for your team, Sergeant? All right, you go ahead. Radio us when you reach the contact location. No problem. What if we run into scrap heads? Shoot them. That's what you Yanks are best at, isn't it? You know, Charlie, maybe I could get to like you after all. Right. <laughs> 